Hello, it's me. Who else could it be? Welcome to Penny's Big Breakaway. Where did the, what, what just happened? Thanks to the indie game community, this world has a couple more platformers still being made. And I'm always keen to check them out. It was only a few weeks ago when I found out that this thing was not gonna be just on the Switch and they actually ended up putting it on PC. So I was like, oh, I can actually play this game now. Oh, it's so adorable. I love how shiny it looks. This controls quite differently than how I expected. There's no camera movement? This game has the energy of a niche platformer you'd own on your GameCube back in the early 2000s. And the AAA market doesn't make many platformers anymore, which it's really nice that the indie game community has been really coming up with this kind of stuff. What does this do for me? Oh, what? <laughs> okay, interesting. A cosmic string, how curious. Perhaps it will serve you well in the audition. Don't delay, getting into Emperor Eddie's palace may not be so easy. It, it just feels weird not having control over the- what? Camera. This feels like I'm gonna have another pizza tower again, where I'm just gonna get really into this game's controls. You know, this is all pretty standard tutorial stuff, all right? Yeah, if this wasn't in HD, you could have tricked me into thinking this was a game that existed on the GameCube and is lost media. The gala auditions have commenced. His Majesty the Emperor will now receive the first performer. Miss Penny, take the stage. It's very charming. The art style is, I wasn't sure if I liked the art style at first, but it's kind of growing on me. Wow, yay. Okay, we, we I don't look like a complete idiot. Uh, I mean, splendid, remarkable show. Oh. <laughs> Why is it? Why'd you not hold the string? Criminal disrobing of the Imperial personage. Criminal chaos in the editorium. It's all on record in the Book of Law. Your multiple malevolent misdeeds. I like the ridiculous premise of it. I like how silly it is. Oh, now the game actually begins. Talk of the town. Oh my god, look at that. I already know how to play this game. <laughs> that was an amazing start. So I can swing, but then I can also attach myself to a wall and jump up from that. Oh, of course, collectibles. If you help out a denizen in a jam, they'll come to see you perform at the end of the stage. A bigger audience means a bigger bonus. I, mean, I haven't gotten the hang of the movement yet. I also have no idea where this fifth bolt even is because I also can't control the camera. I have no camera control in this. Oh, never mind. There it is. Oh, I don't think I need to come back to them to confirm that I completed the mission. All right, I got your lunch back. We got to help all of them to get the true ending. Did I use my dash? No, I, I lost. My, I think I lost my dash at some point. That's fine. You have to touch the ground again to use the dash. I also might be overusing the roll because there's many moments where I'm just traveling too slow to justify it. Oh, we got some golden flagpoles here, don't we? All right, so how could I possibly mess this up? Got it. <laughs> That would have been really embarrassing if I fucked that up. Oh, Jesus. I, I didn't know I had to perform like that. Okay. <laughs> All right. All right. Okay. I got really nervous there. It's like playing Sonic Unleashed again when you have like the really long quick time events. In the Xbox version, at least. I recently played it a couple months ago. So I'm going to like see if I can like speed run this. Okay, that, that works too, I guess. This also keeps me in the air a little longer, it looks like. Honestly, I should break these barrels because they just give me points anyway. I didn't see a ranking system of any kind, so I don't, I'm not gonna think too much about the points. Luckily, these missions are really easy and not too out of the way. I am noticing there's like other collectibles. It's like you complete missions, but there's some other collectibles hidden in the level that I'm definitely not seeing. See, there's many moments where you just gain a shit ton of speed. And I really, I'm awful at maintaining it. There wasn't as huge of an emphasis on speed as I was expecting. There's like many moments where you actually do gain a huge burst of speed and I'm not really sure if I'd ever be able to maintain it. Oh fuck, god damn it. <laughs> Whoops. All right, well, at least the game's merciful. Oh, you can charge this. All right, here we go again. Let, let's see if I can land this. Got it. Okay. <laughs> it, like, it looks so deceptively easy. But I've, I've played Super Mario 3D World where I just fuck it up every now and then. I wonder how fast I... What? What? Come on. What what happened? Was I was I not turning the control stick the right way? What happened? Th this is what I was doing. I was doing this. What does this do? Go wake him up with an alarm clock. <laughs> you goddamn moron. So all I had to do was just stand on the goddamn elevator. Is that so hard? How did I even manage that? Oh, do I have to clear out this road? Is that what it wants me to do? 
Yeah, that is what it wanted me to do. Please tell me we're almost at the end. Oh, oh, they're they're kind of. Oh no! God damn it! I overshot. These penguins are still bothering me. <laughs> Our anniversary is in 20 seconds. What the hell? All right, they they actually made an effort to make these more challenging. I also couldn't find the other five. What? Where the hell were they? Oh no, my wife is going to be disappointed. <laughs> yeah, I am getting more of a 3D World vibe from this instead. All right, I got one more switch to grab. Okay, get me out of here. Eee. Got it. Woo! <laughs> it's really tricky. It's a death perception thing. You, you don't want to do it continuously. Got it. Okay. It, I, I get it now. The inputs all have to be separate to each other. I tried continuously, like, rotating the control stick the first time around. And that didn't work. Oh, that, that's bad. <laughs> all right. Move. Roll faster. Woo. Okay, perfect. Yeah, so what I've been doing, I've been uh, dashing, but then I dash into my roll. It'll be like Pizza Tower. Once I get used to the movement, I'll be like a god at this game. Come on, go higher. Go higher. Whoa, fuck. <laughs> I wasn't sure which direction we were going in. Okay, there we go. God damn. Was that it? <laughs> That was a really fun stage. The Escape the Penguin Ball. Ooh, we have a bonus shop. Show off spotlight Flippy Fish. Saves Penny from one penguin capture. Provides Penny a one-time aerial rescue if she falls off the stage. Penny gains two temporary gusto points. Yeah, that was a good introduction to the game to kind of ease me into the controls. So what, is this what, is this what he wants? Okay, well, I don't really know what that guy wanted. He just needed that wall destroyed. Oh, what the hell's this down here? Go hurry, what? Sesame Beach Balls, find them. Got it. All right, actually completing one of these for once? God damn. <laughs> All right, I thought I had time for that one. Oh, wow, what's this? I actually found one of these? God damn, it's a miracle. Why? What the hell? God damn it, the death perception. I do like how the background is like slightly grainier. I don't know if that's intentional, but it kind of looks cool. What does this do? So it, it, what the goddamn hell? Okay, cool, thanks. Yeah, so I should also make sure I use the control stick more often. Because then I can do some moves that I wouldn't naturally be able to do otherwise. Alright, let's avoid these nets. Avoid the nets. Avoid the nets. And I can roll across the quicksand by rolling. Duh. And these penguins are really bad at their jobs. Ooh. What the fuck? I overshot again. Who the hell are you? Not our year, crew. I know, we worked so hard and I was first in line to perform. But then some bird brain cut right in front of me. Ain't no way all the bosses are just people who are fed up with the fact that Penny cut them in line. <laughs> and that's the only reason they're all fighting. I don't mind taking on a rider, but we're not seaworthy yet. There's an awful lot to... Yep. <laughs> Wait, was she actually in that cutscene? Hey, wait a minute. I know you. You're the air breather that cut in line at the auditions. And stole my spotlight. Is this really why we're all fighting? This is, this is like rather unique. And tricky. I'm actually having a lot of trouble with this. Oh my god, I've lost all my momentum. Ah. Okay, perfect. Oh shit. Come on. Yes, got it. Oh my god. That was actually really difficult. Repair Sheila's ship. What happened there? Can we be friends now? Look at that. Would it taken me and the crew all day to fix her up like this? Thanks, short stuff. You're more ha handy than you look. It's fine. If we wanted to become friends, we just had to beat each other up. Ah, oh, don't walk the plank about it. I'll audition again next year, bigger and better. My crew could use more time to rehearse. Hey, lose focus in front of the audience. All that popcorn. 
Yeah, the art style is really growing on me. It's like, I don't know, all the characters look adorable. Well, she's rigged and ready, and you need to skip town, right? I'm headed to the next port, so... How about a ride? You gotta see worthy again. Least I could do. But if you don't mind, keep a leash on your yo-yo, okay? Ha! I'm gaining more accomplices as I escape from my own crimes. Ooh, what is this place? Okay, you don't want to... Fuck it. <laughs> you don't want to fall into that. Okay, so I do lose health for that. I lose health for falling in the pits, obviously. These bulls charge hard, but if Yo-Yo gives them a good whack, they curl up in the golf balls. Oh. Okay, sure. I want to be a mad speedrunner. I'm just going to be cruising through this game. I don't even know how long this game is. Did I just walk by one of the... Yeah, I did. Like a goddamn goofball. Oh, look at that swinging. So I have a swing and I have a dash. Those are the two things that will keep me moving forward. There is no way I can fuck this up. There is no way I can fuck this up. Got it. Okay, so there's like, when you press the A button while in midair, you do this little twirl that keeps you in the air longer. Okay, now I gotta do all three of these. Like, not only do you have to land on the pedestal, you have to nail all three of these, I think, to get the three stars. Got it. That's the easy part. Landing on that thing is the hard part, because when you do the A button, she does a little flip. When you press the B button, or no, the X button, you can do a little dash. And both of those give you a different amount of horizontal and vertical movement. So you have to choose which one you do at the right moment. Otherwise, you're just going to overshoot everything. If I dash for everything, I'm just going to overshoot most of my, uh, most of the places I intend to land. I feel like this movement tech the game hasn't directly taught me yet. Or I'm just like moving around like a, a psychopath when I shouldn't be. Whoa! <laughs> Do you see that? I'm, I'm nuts! No! <laughs> I overshot again! I keep overshot. I, I wish I had a stomp. If I had a stomp, that'd be much easier. So what does this do? Yo-Yo can ride, can chomp this chili pepper to ride with super speed. Oh! That's really neat. Cool. This area seems so massive. It's like a lot of ground to cover. I also gotta make sure I find a place to land before this timer runs out. Oh, is this loop-de-loop? -loop? Oh, it does. Kind of, in a way. Alright, game, you wanna throw me a bone here? I could use some health. Oh, wait, no, it's the end of the level. That's fine. That's fine, too. Got it. Getting better at those. Ow! <laughs> Don't let the penguins even breathe on it. Oh, this is, this is bad. Okay, here's your battery. All right, I gotta go. Yeah, these levels have been getting longer. All right, now I can just dodge all these guys entirely. Which seemed to have been intended. Wow. Oh, good job, me. All right, there we go. God damn it. <laughs> Landed it anyway. Was there any doubt? I'm the greatest gamer alive. Hello there, Mr. Q. Salutations. I am Mr. Q, a magician of the Imperial Court. I think this art style, I, I think it's the coloring. It kind of reminds me of Bomberman, in a way. Confirmed, you are the wanted criminal who disrupted our gala auditions. I don't know, will everybody around here be as nice as that one pirate we fought? Wait, you have the spark of true talent. The gala would benefit from your skills. Emperor Eddie was once a fair and forgiving ruler, but years ago, he lost his greatest friend. His creative partner was a brilliant performer. None could match her flair for innovation. Dude, he's lore dumping on me. He's lore dumping. I only wish I knew a spell to bring her back. But science has not progressed that far. As for you, Emperor Eddie has been, has been troubled enough. He need never know I found you here. I will do what I must to shield him. Talented as you are, your, ta your tale ends today. <laughs> Dude, he's so tall. This man, this man definitely does leg day. He does everything. He only does leg day. <laughs> okay, they're already starting off kind of tricky. Oh. Is that what you wanted? 
I, t I took damage again. Wow. I Wow. <laughs> it gave me two health points back and I was not able to pick up either of them. Just actually just take your time with it. Like, what am I what am I doing? Fuck, dude. God damn it. That was the most obvious trajectory and I still fucked it up. It's like real billiards. Okay, it looks like it can serve. I have to knock all the balls into the holes. Ow. Not me just barely surviving. Come on. Come on. Yes. Is that it? Okay. <laughs> Not me barely escaping with my life. Yeah, you got bested by a little girl with a yo-yo. Our nation's most brilliant artist, masterful wielder of the cosmic string, dazzling star of our imperial court. I see now why you remind me of her. This string is hers. How did you get it? Did she gift it to you? Did you meet her? Is she well? When will she come home? What is this lore? <laughs> it's gonna it's gonna all come together later. I see. I have been in error. Miss Penny, I apologize. The troubles of our court are not your problem to solve. I will tell no one that I saw you here. You are free to go. But if you do want to learn about that cosmic string of yours, seek out the taboo artist. If she is willing to be found, you might have luck among the mountaintops. She always liked tall places best. I will cast a spell for your success. Does the spell help me in any way? Like gameplay wise? This area is called Molto Bene? I want to assume that's how that's pronounced. We're only on World 4 and we're already at the lava place. Oh, this looks really cool. What is that? Of course. Of course. I wonder if there are like secret- what? Maybe that wasn't a secret. <laughs> All right, then. Okay, this art style is starting to grow on me. This game is actually really pretty. I need butter to spread it all over. Is this what you want? Like... What are, what are we doing? What are, what are these people doing? What do they want from me? All right, thanks. I'm getting much better with the controls. Oh, no, the, the penguins are green now. Wait, am I not supposed to be buttering this? It, it, it... Oh, okay, sure. Yeah, this kind of reminds me of Green Hill Zone from Sonic, but it's like all lava. All right, that looks good. Oh, <laughs> I meant to land into, like, a roll. All right, well, I want it to look cool there. Oh, here we go. Oh, Jesus. I, I was, like, so hesitant there. I was like, do I press the A button or the X button? What do I do? <laughs> I don't know. For me, there's something really satisfying about the rolling in this. I don't know. Just rolling down a hill and just, like, navigating through all of it. It's really satisfying. What is up here? I was kind of thinking there was going to be a secret here. Like, I feel like this game could... Uh, lend itself really well to just having like secret levels hidden somewhere. Yeah, I think I'm really getting the hang of the movement now. Where am I even going? Sure, we'll go up. Th we'll go over there. Yes, the spotlight. All right, I guess you're coming with me. <laughs> sure, you can come along if you want. Oh shit. Oh, that's really cool looking. What is happening? What? <laughs> what? What even happened there? Did that just throw me into the fire? Oh, look at that. That was so sick. I, I knew I had that wall jump ready. Where's he gonna draw me? Fuck! <laughs> it handed me that one. It handed me that one and I still messed it up. I like how the end of the stage is the hardest part where I just cannot land that. I just cannot land that to save my life. Whoa! Oh, wow. My job is safe and normal. Uh, sure. Yeah, whatever you say. I, I didn't realize the lava was rising there. I wonder how much speed I need to actually, like, roll through this lava. Sometimes it seems inconsistent. I think it's giving, it's giving me so many opportunities to just chain all my moves together and, like, flow through the level seamlessly. Or I always had the opportunity, and I just wasn't good at the game yet. Like, I, I'm really starting to feel the speed side of this, because at, at the beginning of the game, I was only really feeling like, it's, it seems like a platformer, but the, the whole speed part of this, I wasn't really feeling yet. And what do you need here? My dishes need chili. Um. Oh, shit. Am I gonna make this? Okay, I did make it. <laughs> it, it was just like, that one was too easy. I couldn't fuck that one up. Now is not the time to throw a tantrum, your highness. The gala must continue as planned. The founding principle of the annual gala is to delight and dazzle your denizens. 
with fresh feats of artistic accomplishment. I don't know. It, it, do you have to be the bigger man if someone shows up to your performance and then takes your clothes? <laughs> like, did, would anyone else let that slide if that happened to you? Gala is the heart of this country, all of Macaroon. Is that what this place is called? No, I can't do it. I'll be a laughing stock. Then make your new act a comedy. God, scream. Uh, scream, I guess. <laughs> Good afternoon, Miss Felon. He knew I was there. He knew I was there the whole time with a sixth sense. We'll add eavesdropping to your list. <laughs> Take this soap to my stinky friend. Oh, almost overshot. Almost overshot. His friend really said, take a shower, bro. <laughs> I do like how no world overstays its welcome. Just when I think, like, I kind of need a change of scenery for this level, then the game just decides to send me somewhere new, which is nice. What does he need with these crates? Oh, okay. Sure. I, I think I needed them to move on anyway. You know what? Fuck it. I don't need that checkpoint. Okay, now I immediately regret my decision. Yeah, it really ups the tension, right? It really ups the thrill when I don't take the checkpoint. I think when I enter my dash while on a slope, it like gives me a much higher acceleration from the get-go. Which I should keep in mind, if that makes sense. This level is also really pretty. I like the color palette here. It's like the nice mix of pink and green. It's not too over-designed either. Oh, shit. Wow, god damn it. Got it. That was a direct hit. That was easy. I do like how seamless it is. It is just level to level to level. There's no like, it doesn't, it doesn't always interrupt you to go back to the world map, which I really like. It just keeps the game moving. Oh God, now they're stacking on top of each other. All right, there you are. Here, take the towels. Yeah, I get a lot of Mario 3D world energy from this. And there actually do seem to be alternate paths to different places. Like, see, if I didn't grab that collectible, I wouldn't have died. <laughs> Okay, how the hell would I have done that? How in the heck would I have gotten here? All right, well, that's as good as it's gonna get. I have no idea how I could have got the gold pillar on that. Oh, it's giving me a lot of ground to uh, roll on here. Oh, ow. All right, unfortunately, I think we're gonna have to wait. But not as long as I thought we would have to. So I gotta take this to someone. Don't let it get wet. I'll do my best. I mean, first of all, where is the guy? What in the hell was that? What? <laughs> what even happened there? Like, I always gotta remember to use that wall jump because it's actually quite useful. Was there any doubt? Was there any doubt? I'm the best. I'm the best. I'm the best Penny's Big Breakaway player. What did I do? What? <laughs> what? What? What did I mess up? I definitely input it right. How come that one cutscene with the pirate was was done in game, but all of these others were just drawings? Oh, that's really awkward. Okay. We'll, we'll probably this will be our first of several fights, I assume. <laughs> I love it. I love it. It's fine. I took the hit, but that was a good trade. Oh no, he's charging his power. Oh shit. Well, that was that was such a lie. Why would why would they make me do that? That might have been the easiest boss fight so far. That was such an easy boss fight. So now I beat up the king. How many more crimes does that add to my list? Pull the plug on this pip squeak. Look who's washed up now. All right, so he sent me to the world's edge. <laughs> All right, cool. I was expecting some sort of sewer level, not the edge of reality. Dude, he sent me to a Super Mario Sunshine level. Wow, I, I don't know how I could have ever climbed that wall without that. Like, did they think those parts through? I, I feel like it's intended that I'm meant to pull those shelves out so I can climb on them, but they gave Penny a, like, a wall jump or a wall climb. Oh, ow. All right, let, let's do this right. Let's do this right for once in our lives.
Got it. See, is that so hard? Is that so difficult? I don't know how I possibly fucked that up before. Oh, I gotcha. That's kind of cool. Wait, am I traveling through the level upside down now? Oh, this sounds fun. I gotta beat this thing to... Oh, wow, that thing's traveling faster than I thought. Um... Oh, that's... Fuck. That's a portal to take me back. Okay, that makes a lot more sense. Oh, I see. So I was meant to come up here, grab this torch, and then this should give me a freebie. Yeah, I probably have to collect everything in order to get something like that. That would be the only way I could probably get a score that high. Alright, so where the hell is your friend? Alright, that was easy. I'm not gonna wait around for these platforms. Got it! <laughs> I think I missed one of the collectibles, but whatever. I care about speed. Yeah, it looks like you have to stop your combo if you want to be able to pick up any other item. So th there's no P-ranking this kind of shit, you know? Where you just, like, hold a combo the entire level. Oh, I can twirl and grab it like that, though. So maybe I can keep my combo going. Yeah, I really feel like these levels have the most 3D world energy so far. This definitely feels like a 3D world level. And I mean that as a compliment. Like, 3D world is a very good game. I overshot again. <laughs> it's not quite a golden flagpole. It's much more difficult to uh, calculate the trajectory for. I don't know how this happened. I don't know how your keys got stuck in these blocks, but I'll happily help you. I feel like I'm speeding through this level. It's only been a minute and a half. Maybe I'm getting better at this game. There is one more person I need to help in this level. I'm looking for him. I might as well. I'm already this close. Or, well, anyway, we're already at the end of the level. You really think that's going to stop me? Like, did they really think that was going to stop me? The only thing that was hindering me from the golden pillar was myself. So how the hell do I get out of wherever the hell they sent me? Oh, hi. We don't get many new bodies here in the cosmic waste. Oh, what the... Puppet Penny. This one's a little lacking in the height department. You like my cosmic Mario? Do I have to race you? Oh, it is a race. That's so cool. But honestly, we all know who's winning this. <laughs> okay, hold up. No, I'm the faster. I'm the superior penny. What? Okay, jeez, what the hell? I'm like locked in now. Like this is actually this is actually kind of difficult. The, the controls get a little odd at this angle. Oh shit! Oh, wait, what? Not enough coins. Oh, I needed more coins to beat him too. I didn't even realize that either. So I'll actually pay attention this time. Oh, okay, that would have been way easier if I just did it that way. See? All right, so we're definitely winning in the coin department. It's just, like, really difficult to roll in this. <laughs> I'm, like, so locked in right now. I'm so incredibly locked in. Oh, okay. I don't know how that made any sense. I, I wasn't sure what was going to change gravity and what wasn't. You outperformed my puppet. Impressive. And the fellow wielder of the cosmic strain. Why, the stars must be smiling upon us. What a curious companion you've created. Not just anyone can master these threads. Even the magical Mr. Q, you never even manage it. Has our almighty emperor finally unbent and sent you to offer the apology I deserve? Oh, never mind then. Wait. So that's how it is. I should have known. Eddie never changes. That was always his problem. But it became mine in the end. Before his solo act as Emperor, we used to perform together, you know. Our notorious, legendary, anarchic, immortal, wonderful double act show. Every show, Eddie played the lead. And I? You in the stage crew? Oh. 
I directed everything else. The world's strongest man starring in the world's strangest theater. Never the same show twice. God damn! <laughs> we packed the rafters, we traveled the continents, but he got tired of my tireless experiments. And I got tired of him being tired. You need to get home, but Eddie's land isn't home for you anymore. Yeah, because I'm wanted. I don't think I could go back there ever again. Oh, you're in the Book of Law. Well, in that case, why not rewrite history? Is time traveling? We, we time traveling? The Book of Law is absolute as it is written, so it must be. Do you understand, little artist? With the rip of a page, you can reshape your fate. The twin to this teleporter is hidden inside the Lawberry Courthouse. Sneak inside and get that Book of Law. That old fuddy-duddy Judge Rufus won't have the faintest clue. What fun! Little artist, I expect to see your name in lights over the gala stage someday. Sparkling future lies before you. Now go and seize it! But hold, how the hell did we get from Zapphara to Molto Bene? And also, I didn't take the time to listen to the world map music. It's really, it's really good. Oh. <laughs> well, that's not good. Oops. Good luck, little artist. I'm sure you'll figure it out. I mean, like, we're in Pengoville. I can only assume this place is only composed of penguins. Yeah, I, I think that would be a really nice detail if none of the- there's no NPCs to help around here. You just have to avoid all the penguins. Also, where the hell is the guy I've got to deliver this to? Oh, hi. There you are. Jeez. That was a long sequence. Wow. I, I tried everything in my power to dodge that. I do like the penalty how game overs and losing lives, or I guess losing health, they only affect your score, which is good. I kind of like that much better. Land it? Yes! Oh, shit. I almost completely fucked that up. I, I don't know. I lost track of my movement tech there. These balloons... No problem, I think. Death perception will be the death of me here. What? How did I miss that? Look how fast I'm moving. Only a minute and a half in. All right, some of these missions, I guess like it's easy enough, so I'll do them. Yeah, at the rate I'm going in, these levels are roughly three minutes, which I think that's a pretty good length, especially at the speed I'm moving now, because like I was able to defeat this level or beat this level. Come on. I was able to beat this level in pretty much exactly three minutes. We land these. Where's my shadow? There it is. <laughs> I just had to make sure, all right? Just had to be absolutely sure. There's probably a lot of things I don't know about this game, and I'm just like speeding through so quickly. Like, I like that the movement can be fast, and I like platformers where I'm moving fast. I like platformers that tie the movement so well together that I can just like speed through and like navigate through this really, like in a really efficient way. Oh, look at that. Look at that timing. That was insane. My friend is stuck on the ice. And where the hell is your friend exactly? Oh. All right, perfect. See, sometimes it's not very clear where I'm supposed to be going for said mission. Like I said, those are some of the most satisfying parts of the game. Oh, wow. I still kept the combo going despite that. That was crazy. I think I've got to go up. Where the hell was the platform? <laughs> Did you see that? The platform disappeared. Oh, I see it. It's all the way over there. Hello? Goddamn. <laughs> I don't know why I was struggling so much there. Easy. I don't know why I have so much trouble with that. It, it's like, there's literally a shadow that shows you where you're about to land. I like how none of the townspeople rat me out. I really appreciate it. Only the penguins seem to be after me. <laughs> I'm still wanted, hi. Wrapped up my delivery run. Now I'm heading to Industria. 
Wanna ride out of here? Might be closer to where you're going. Yes, be part of my crimes. Be my accomplice. <laughs> All right, saddle up crew, we're shipping out. I don't know, we would be getting in the final act territory, honestly, Industria. World eight, I mean, traditionally in every platformer, and by that I mean every platformer like Mario, there's normally only eight worlds. Whoa, I probably chose the harder path here. Oh, there's a lot of penguins this time around. God damn it. <laughs> I didn't mean to use my dash. I like this new magnet mechanic. It's very satisfying to use. It just lifts you up. Whatever will I do with the lasers? It's not like I can just, oh, walk through them. Oh, shit. That was really cool. Oh, fuck. Damn it. I wasn't expecting that. Thread the needle. Yes. Thread the needle. Yeah, hitting it on a slant, that gets you much more speed. Yeah, that boosts you so much further. Oh god, there's so many penguins. Fuck! God damn it! I focus so hard on that part. I'm like flowing through this. I'm in my gamer mode. I've completely locked in now. I think I completely understand the movement, at least to my capacity. Alright, come on. This isn't supposed to be difficult. <laughs> I don't know why I struggled so much on that part. Oh, more penguins. Yeah, I don't think the levels are getting shorter. I'm just getting much faster at this. Ow. Oh, wow. I'm moving really fast now. Yeah, this looks like final world territory. I think we're in the final act. I didn't overshoot it this time. I actually did it correctly. Okay, let's see if I can do the three star. Okay. Is that giving me more coins? And in turn, like what? The coins are like 100 points each. I don't know if that really helps me. I actually don't know what those numbers mean then. Because that seems really small. So what are we waiting for here? What, is, what are we up against? Oh. Wow, it literally waited for me to land. Where is this magnet? Why is it not spawning? Like this is how, this is what I assume I'm supposed to be doing? Shit. I'm locked in. I'm honestly locked in. Like this might be the hardest boss I've faced so far. Okay, we've got farther this time. I'm going to continue before that breaks anything. <laughs> that, oh, what the? No, I'm losing in the cutscene. This is a world nine. This is a goddamn world nine. Was that it? Like, they're not gonna make any sort of deal out of the fact that I just broke out? Okay, yeah, that would, that would be very useful. This is like the second time I've seen this item. Oh, okay, that's what the switch does. I, I was so confused. Oh, okay. You want me to break out your buddies? I actually got a decent amount of stuff this time around. Oh, shit. All right. God damn it. <laughs> All that work just not to get the golden pillar. Again, I really don't know why it was so easy just to just escape out of that cage. I assume those pink ones are very dangerous and I should never touch them. It's fine. I should be able to break this before those guys even have a chance to rob me. Not rob me, capture me. <laughs> I don't know why I said rob me. Okay, we don't need to get fancy here. Uh, don't dash unless you have to. I feel like I dash way too often in this. But I want to say this is most likely the final world. This is definitely the end game at this point. <laughs> Did you see that penguin stuck in the wall? <gasps> oh shit, Jesus! Okay, be very careful with that. Oh, lovely. All right, that could have been bad. Oh my God, how did I get that? <laughs> that was crazy, how did I get that one? I don't know how long this game is, but I've honestly been playing this entire game in one sitting. I've just been having a lot of fun with it. Like I'm always down to try more platformers made by indie game companies because I sure as hell know that the mainstream market doesn't do it. There's also a lot of dialogue from all these characters around me, but I just haven't been stopping to check because I, I just like, 
I like the movement in this game and I like moving fast in this game. So I just end up speeding through everything. And I'm definitely missing all the collectibles. Oh, wait, I'm, I'm invincible. I'm fucking invincible. Why would I even need to do this? Whoa. That camera angle really threw me off. Wow, that is, that really tripped me up. Oh, okay. Well, someone ain't getting their evidence. So I gotta pop these balloons. Uh, how expansive is this mission? Okay, it looks like it takes place on the entirety of this road. All right, perfect. Oh. Um, something tells me I was supposed... Oh, great. <laughs> something tells me I was supposed to use that hamburger yo-yo to do something else. Whoops. Okay. Well, I looked like a complete moron that time. I like how most of the challenge in this game has come from me trying to land on this stage. I can never land on this stage properly. So what does this lead? Like, why did they let me out of this cage? <laughs> Felony! Oh, is the judge my ultimate opponent? Felony, felony, felony. Aggravated jailbreak, aiding and abetting. Conspiracy to commit courtroom chaos. So we just need to get the book, shred it, and then he can't... That acquits us for some reason. Okay. So what is the strat here? Oh. Good thing he made this easy. <laughs> Good thing he made this really easy. I, I did it again, where I, I accidentally dash, but I mean to just hit. I think I just have to break them once. No? Okay, you gotta do it more than once. Okay, well, that's one of them. Damn it. <laughs> okay. I, I at least get what I'm doing now. God, I did it again. I accidentally dashed off the platform again. This cannot be. Nobody escapes justice. True justice is inescapable. Just try to dodge. Oh. What is that? If you were innocent, you'd stand still. Stop dodging. What was I supposed to do there, exactly? <laughs> I guess I'm just gonna have to eat that. I don't know. I, I really wasn't sure how to dodge that. Got it. Nice loop. So what, is this, what does this do for us? Even if the scales proclaim your innocence, the law of the land will always be absolute. What the heck just happened? No. No! I don't believe it! <laughs> He's so well animated. I love it. Look, I just need to grab the book. Tear the page out. Nice try, you conniving little creature. Grand theft. Contempt of the court. Biting in the first degree. I'll drag you down to the cells myself. Throughout your impressive criminal career, this court considered Yo-Yo your accessory. Yet just now, it acted on its own. I was gonna be surprised if this was the final boss, because I was like, there's still a few more pieces of the story that I'm not getting here about this Yo-Yo. Perhaps we might consider this a mitigating circumstance. Miss Felon, Miss Penny. The court will make this offer once. You may go free. Your home will welcome you again. I will even grant you a spot on stage at the gala. The emperor could certainly use the help. But I gotta give up the yo-yo. But you must relinquish yo-yo to me. The law can bend, but it must not break. Yo-Yo is a dangerous, disruptive element. To restore order and dignity to this land, I must snap this creature's string.
No, don't take the yo-yo. <laughs> you refuse, even if you can never perform here again. Very well. There's something special about this yo-yo. Oh my god, the game just the game just continues. <laughs> There's so much. So where where are we going with this? At this point, looks like some. Oh wait, this is like the night of the gap. Wow. That's what that means. This is like where the, the ceremony is about to begin for the emperor. Yeah, we've essentially gone full circle. We're just back at the very beginning of the game. Do I even need to engage with this? Like, look, I can just climb the wall. <laughs> I, I, I have no idea if they thought that through. Oh, okay. I need to break this. And, and even after all of that, Okay, <laughs> it is 100% accurate. The trajectory on that is 100% accurate. Yeah, this this soundtrack is so groovy. I really like it. Like, I don't have too much more to say about this game. I'm just like really enjoying myself with this. It's very well made. Oh wow, now we're really picking up speed. Whoa, I thought that killed me. Oh, hi. I don't know what happens if these guys grab me. I'm going to assume I instantly die or something. I'll be very interested to see what a speedrun of this game looks like. Alright, what does this switch do? Oh, it activates a coin. Give that to me. Do I really need to do that? I could've just walked around. <laughs> There's just so many penguins. Okay, oh, thank god. Woo. Land it. Yes! This is a good game. I, I feel like I'm still not taking full advantage of the moveset either. I'd have to I'd have to mess with it later. Yeah, I'm invested. I'm invested. I want to see this through to the end. I've played basically this entire game in one sitting. What the? Yet another area? Man, I have no idea when this game's gonna end. It's crazy. Editorium sounds familiar. Have I been here? All right, now they're on fire. God damn it. Yeah, this game is actually a lot longer than I expected, too. I do appreciate that when you pick up an item, it actually does save it, so you don't have to go pick it up again if you die. Yeah, I suppose, like, the grainy effect in the background is meant to kind of give it, like, a more early 2000s, pre-HD console kind of feel. I like it. Is there a way to descend, like, without jumping out of it? Yeah, this is really interesting because I feel like this is a situation where I should be able to control the camera, but I can't. Like, the camera's just kind of locked. All right, I don't even need to engage with this. I'm just gonna fly around it. This is, what the fuck? God damn. All right, do I got enough air in me? Do I got enough air in me? I think I'm leaning too close to the mic, I'm sorry. It, it, that just happens when I get locked in. Why does this look like the Chow Garden results stage? Like in the Chow races in Sonic Adventure. <laughs> Why is that what this looks like? That's what the background reminds me of. Whoa, oh my goodness. <laughs> wow, those guys all leaped right at me. What? The? God damn it, dude. I honestly, that looked way shorter than I expected it to be. Really, my only thing with this game is this, it's hard to calculate some trajectories every now and then. Oh, shit. Um. Is this part of the mission? I haven't failed it yet. Oh, it is. Gotcha. Okay, see, that's plenty of space. I have, like, a lot of options for how to calculate my forward momentum when I jump. I have, like, a decent amount of options. It, you, I have, like, three different ones. All right, I need this magnet. Easy coin. This is a long level. Or or am I just... Have I just been dying? Oh, they count as two penguins. That's why. Oh, wow. I was so focused there. That's when I'm at my most focused. Trying to land on this golden pillar. Yeah, I don't see anybody use yo-yos anymore. It's like a that's like a toy from like before the 2000s. That's weird. There's like some you never, you don't see that you don't see kids carrying around something like that anymore. Yeah, I saw an alternate path over there. I wonder what that was. Probably a collectible, but I just didn't feel like going back to check. All right, this guy needs some score. Easy. Yeah, that was really easy. The score ones are, like, not as hard as they sound. Oh, you bitch. <laughs> they almost got me there. They almost had me on the run. 
Oh, look at me dive through that fire. Oh, shit. You ever have that moment in platformers where the movement just kind of clicks with you? And you're just like, you're just suddenly locked in because you just understand the movement so well. I think I'm finally at that point. I think I finally get the movement. I'm just like, where are we going? How many, how many more worlds are there? I was actually surprised the game has gone on this far. Wow, that is a long jump. What the fuck happened there? Ooh. All right, it's not over yet. Yeah, where the hell are they? Oh, I got it. Oh my goodness. That was actually really close. I was like, where the hell is he? That is some tight platforming. Oh, I couldn't make it. <laughs> my depth perception isn't good enough for such tiny ass platforms. Um, where the hell am I? Oh my goodness. I was, I was so confused there. Look, was that so hard? Hello? <laughs> what happened? Hold up, I'm, I'm slowly getting out. Okay, what the hell was that? Oh, here we go again with the small platforms. It's fine. I just wanted the coin. Honestly, this feels like one of the longest levels in the game. And I still am not really sure if this is the final level. Yeah, I don't know if it has the final level energy. Who knows? Anything can happen in this circus of a game. But honestly, I'm still having fun. I just think I think this game's really good. Oh wow, they're they're making it easy for me, aren't they? <laughs> I feel like if I didn't do anything, it would have given it to me. Welcome to the annual Imperial Gala. What a crowd! What a night! We auditioned promising new acts this year. Did we now? Or, or we would have if our Emperor's underpants hadn't been, uh... Don't mention, don't draw attention to it. Now introducing our new, fresh, never before seen, absolutely unexpected headlining act. <laughs> Eddie, the Emperor. So did it always look this lame? Hi. There you are, little artist. We can't let him go on like this, can we? Why don't you get up there and work some magic? This stale old show could use your help. <laughs> it's time to fix this show, dude. Oh, what the? <laughs> well, that's awkward. Hello. You! You're the reason everything's gone wrong. You're the reason everyone laughs at me. I'll crush you like a bug. I'll smash you in the pace. I'll, I'll. <laughs> I can't be too loud. Oh, what the? I mean, okay, that was pretty cool. That'll get the audience like cheering. Hey, short stuff. Looks like you could use this. It'd be a shame for this show to stop short. Tonight only, Yo-Yo's powers will be unlimited. Good luck, little artist. Oh. I- it, whoops. <laughs> what am I waiting for here? Okay. I, do I have to tug on his cape like before? Oh, okay. What the? <laughs> that was just a warm-up. Meet your match with Eddie's mega muscles. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> He's swole now. Is that what was supposed to happen? There we go. No. <laughs> Oh, the crowd's just laughing at him. The crowd's just making fun of him. Oh. Ow. God damn, I don't I don't get much time to react there. Oh shit. He actually caught it. Oh. Yikes! Come on! It looks so goofy. <laughs> I 
Is that it for him? Ow. I tried my best to be the leading man. I really did. But something's missing. I was so much stronger when I was part of a pair. I've been so stubborn, I wish I could tell you. If only you were here again. Taboo. Was Taboo the one that made the yo-yo? I was like missing that part of the lore. It's okay. <laughs> I love that pose she does. Well, well, I feel positively inspired tonight. And that's consequential coming from me. What do you say? Shall we see something new? Taboo. Eddie. The show must go on. Wait, what? Wait, wait, <laughs> wait, what, what are we doing? Miss Penny, accept this assistance. Ride the penguin flock to the top of this cosmic colossus. Oh wait, I want this. I, I need this. Uh, the plot's lost me. What does Taboo want? Does she just want to work with Eddie again? Oh, I can fly through it. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> um, where does that start me? Oh, hi again. God damn it. Oh shit, this is getting really trippy. Oh, hi, Judge. I probably need this. Whoa. <laughs> Ow. Holy shit, dude. Okay, I just need to reach the screw. I just need to survive. But the depth perception's really messing with me. All right, unscrew this. And what does that do for us? Oh, I get it. We just wanted to put on a cool show. That's <laughs> so wholesome. What a what an awesome game! I had a lot of fun with that because I was like, well, I think I was watching this game for at least the past few months because I was really curious of where this was gonna go. I was kind of surprised that it wasn't as speed based as I was expecting it to be, but I still liked it. I thought it was very well paced. I thought all the levels were really good. It's fun stuff. It's good stuff. Oh, we got the post credit cutscene. I mean, my I'm still in the book of law, aren't I? Yep. <laughs> Miss Felon. Or perhaps I should call you Miss Demeanor. You owe the court some community service. Alright, I'll take this compromise, honestly. One whirling wafer is worth, to be precise. What is my community service? No, wait, unironically though. Unironically, is it is it actually like if I helped everybody I could possibly help in the game? I got a different cutscene there. Yeah, we're not doing that. <laughs> 